I'm Emma from The Journey, and this is my coworker, Darlene, from GoDaddy's How-To Videos. And we are coming together today to talk about ways to boost your sales during this COVID-19 crisis by running promotions or offering coupons. We realize that it may seem counterintuitive to offer discounts or coupons when times are tough, but now is the right time because you want to encourage your customers to continue to buy from you. And let's face it, some of your customers may be struggling, so a good promotion or coupon may be just the thing they need to get them to make that buying decision. Over the past few weeks, I've seen restaurants and stores offering unique things in my area here in San Diego. Uh, for example, I've seen some of my favorite stores and restaurants selling gift cards and at a discounted rate. And this is a great way to earn revenue right now. And your loyal customers who love to come to your establishment they're going to want to do so more than ever when social distancing is a thing of the past. Some restaurants that I know have gotten creative with their takeout options too. I've seen some of them offering free dessert with takeout orders and some are selling full or half trays of their most popular items at a great price. Yeah, most of the companies that I buy products through online are offering free shipping right now, which I'm super frugal, so I love this. And with more and more people turning to online shopping, especially during the COVID-19 crisis, this is a no-brainer. And of course, the other thing I've seen are a lot of special coupons and discounts with my favorite retailers. I've seen offers for buy one, get one free, or a certain percentage amount if I spend so much. And I know a good sale can entice me to buy something that I've been thinking about. Yeah, totally. These are all great ideas for running promotions during this time. And Darlene, can you show us how to create coupon codes for our websites and marketing e-commerce customers? Yeah, I'd be happy to do that, Emma. Let's get to it. We're going to start on the Websites Plus Marketing dashboard. From there, let's choose Marketing and select Coupons. Select Add to add a new coupon. We're now on the Create Coupon page. First, we need to create a coupon code. This is what customers enter during the checkout process. If the coupon you're creating is representing a certain sale or free shipping, make that part of the code. For example, running a sale right now on the COVID-19 crisis, you might wanna use stay safe or stay healthy as the code. If you aren't feeling creative, that's okay. You can click the get a code link and one will be generated just for you. We're gonna use stay safe. The code can be between 3 and 30 characters, and it's not case sensitive. Now you need to select when you want the coupon to start and end. If you don't want the coupon to expire, check the Never End box. The Options section is used to add restrictions to the coupon. You can limit the coupon to a product or category. Just check the box and make your selections. You can also set the maximum number of products per order that will receive the discount. For example, you only want to give 20% off of one item. The next option gives us the ability to limit the number of total uses that the coupon can be used by everyone, not just one customer. For example, you want to give 20% off, but only to the first 100 customers. You can add that restriction here. If you want to require a minimum order total, you can add that in this section. Maybe you're offering a coupon for $10 off once the customer reaches a certain threshold. We're not going to add any restrictions at this time, so we're going to click Save. Now you're back on the main coupon page. You can see an overview of the coupon details. And you can edit the coupon by clicking the pencil icon or delete it by clicking the trash can. That's it. That's how you make coupon codes. Thank you, Darlene. Hey, that does look pretty easy. I hope you thought so too. Once you have your coupon set up, uh, make sure you share the information with your customers. Put it front and center on your site and send an email to existing customers to let them know. And don't forget to share over on social media too. And we understand that times are tough right now for everyone. So letting your customers know that you're still here, ready to help them is always a good thing. It was great to see you, Emma. Hey, you too, darling. Stay healthy. Stay safe. <laughs>